Hello YouTube, my name is Simon and today I will show you how to downgrade your iPod Touch 3, 3G into 3.1.2 uh, when you do the, the upgrade 3.1.3 just uh, by mistake so 3.1.3 into 3.1.2 uh, <laughs> I will tell you uh, now. I, I'm not uh, American. I'm Canadian, so my language is not very good in English. But I will just help you to do that. I want to help. So, okay. First of all, you just you just have to plug your iPod Touch in your computer, and you must have iTunes. <laughs> If you don't have iTunes, you have a big problem. I think okay after that when all all your when uh, your iPod touch is plugged you just got to go to uh, the site Felix Lebrun anyway it's in my description so just just get, just go in my description and um, go to the hurl um, and you download this the firmware oh, but I, I will tell I will just show you so we go in my description we go at the link and you see that screen okay so you go at iPhone and iPod touch there you go at bottom and there you you have iPod touch 3G 3.1.3 you and uh, iPod touch 3G 3.1.2 Do not take this one. All the video take this one and doesn't work It's like a um, always have mistake when you restore your iPod. So you take the iPod Touch 2 generation 3.1.2, okay? And after you see that red things, but you download it. After you will have this screen of mega mega upload. You just tap the card there. Just one second. After you download it, and you just have to wait um, like one. Oh, you just have to wait. <laughs> okay. Um, I will. Okay, after when it's downloaded, you you just put it in your desktop because it's more easy after to uh, find the um, the fill. And you must you must um, do a backup into iTunes or just a backup of your music and your games because if you don't backup all your files in your iPod, you will lose all the things and you will not be happy so we download we download it like this and after you see that that screen you um, you just save as at your desktop and after when it's at your desktop I don't put at my desktop because uh, I already do the downgrade so when it's done it's um, downloaded it's like it's it's not pretty long but I think it's like five minutes you open iTunes ah uh, I'll read open okay when iTunes is open just like all video you see with uh, okay, okay. You, you just uh, open Windows uh, open Windows open iTunes And you go at your iPod, and if you want a backup, you just click there, and like that, you make a backup, you wait, and you have a backup of your iPod. Okay, after to restore it, you just have to click Shift and Restore. Okay, and after you will see um, a screen like that. Okay, you will see a screen like that, okay? So after that, you take your 
uh, your firmware that you download at uh, the link Felix Lebrun, the link in my description, and then I will not uh, restore my iPod because it's already restored and all works. So you, you restore, you wait like uh, five minutes, ten minutes, it depends. And after um, your iPod Touch 3G will be in 3G 3.1.2 and this is all I got to say and sorry for my <laughs> English but I just want to help you guys so you see there iPod 3.1.2 and this is it so if you want some help just send me a message on my YouTube um, by on on the YouTube video and this is it